Hey guys, Mr. Ruby, and today I'll be explaining my thoughts on Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. And today, if you haven't seen it yet, there is a second trailer released. And if you haven't seen the first trailer, go watch both of them, I guess, if you haven't seen any of them. And if you don't even know what I'm talking about, well, whatever. Um, but, uh, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood is Quentin Tortino's ninth film. And it might be his last. He hasn't even made ten yet. It would be cool if he hits ten, and then it's like, okay, because uh, Christopher Nolan... He's been gone since 1999, he's already at 10, and then he's been gone since 1994. <laughs> Probably before that, but 1994 is Pulp Fiction, so. But, um, but, um, this movie's actually not looking too violent. I know in the second trailer there was a uh, flamethrower scene, but, um, in 1965, 1969, the Nazis weren't there, so, yeah. I was at 59. Still, there was no Nazi, Nazis there, and, um, so there's, that's most likely part of a movie, because I remember in War of the Worlds, there was people being laid on fire and stuff, so, you know. and then also there was the one shooting scene, but that, that, that's most likely for a movie, just without the camera, or, or maybe, or there's also, but then there was that one scene at the end of the second trailer where they were, where Margot Robbie was holding a gun, yeah. But I'm thinking it's most likely, if it would be R, it's going to be rated R for profanity, nudity, and, um, sexuality. But, yeah. Yeah, but it might actually be PG-13. There's a... It might be that, you know, or just Contortino's films are, are all going to be R. But, um... And then, also... Yeah, like, DiCaprio, Brad Pitt, and, um, uh, Margot Robbie, also Al Pacino, Kurt Russell, Dakota Fanning... I can keep going on if I feel like it, but I won't. That's a huge cast of really good actors who could do a lot of stuff and most likely will deliver in this movie, which make will which will make the movie even better. Yeah, and um, yeah, and then Tortino at the chair, which I've heard he's made good movies before. I haven't seen any of them. Yeah, there's reasons. But um. Yeah, it looks like it's a good mo It looks like it's gonna be a solid movie. Pretty good. Probably gonna win a couple Oscars, or it's just gonna win every single Oscar, or it's just gonna be a big snub, like Christopher Nolan's movies. But yeah, I think it's. I think it's gonna be a uh, pretty good. And um, in the comments, say what you think of it. And uh, yeah, see you next time, movie fans.